scourge of crime and violence uh, impacts all of us. Um, and that led me to, to really reflect on what I could do, uh, what my ministry could do uh, to work along with the Ministry of Home Affairs and with the Belize Police Department. How could we partner uh, to make a positive difference in the lives of these young people who, in too many cases, are painfully um, at the center of this scourge of crime and violence, uh, particularly affecting our urban communities, and here in Belize City, uh, particularly affecting our south side communities. Uh, and so we discussed it, and we said, you know, let's start with trying to have a direct impact on, on 40 young people in these communities. And we used 40, of course, because this is the 40th anniversary of Belize's independence. What we are giving is a vote of confidence to our young men and women. A lifeline, a blank check, a reminder that we love and support them. A reminder that Belize is rooting for them. We want them to win too. These are 40 messages, messages of hope, messages of opportunity, 40 messages of empowerment, 40 messages that we have not given up on them, 40 reminders that we believe in who they are and what their potential is when they are given a real chance. These 40 skills training scholarships to our young men and women is a loud statement. A statement of confidence and trust. A commitment to a belief in the reality of who you are as a person, not a cheap handout.